This question is simply uh, based on the tri triangle inequality. Maybe uh, if you are aware of tri triangle inequalities, everybody aware. The sum of two sides always greater than third side and difference of two sides. Difference of two sides is less than the third side. The simple uh, basic. So it's a directly the moment when they say that key sides of triangle means a triangle inequality can be applied and P is unknown and P integral value we can find that the basic idea is this. The first thing is that key first let's uh, uh, they make it mess up here. Let's, let's make it uh, uh, crystal clear. This is the A square plus uh, B square P square plus 9 B square plus 9c square minus 6ab minus 6pbc equal to 0. First try to convert, make pair, whoever can be combined. So a square is there, 9b ab is there and 9b square. They can be combined and this will become what? a minus 3b whole square, correct? And these can be combined, p square, p square, 9c square, c square and this will become plus bp minus bp minus uh, 3c whole square very simple question sum of two square sum of two square equal to zero means x square plus y square equal to zero this can be true only we are talking about real value eh? if x and y are real then this always gives you x equal to y equal to zero means all both has to be zero then only it can be zero that same logic i can apply so this has to be zero means a minus 3b equal to zero bp bp minus 3c equal to zero now i can get it the relation between the sides a equal to 3b means one side length is the three time of other one and from here also c we can say bp uh, p by 3 into b so now I can write, we can make triangle like this. Suppose this length is the, uh, this is the capital A, this is the capital B, capital C. Cap opposite capital A, small a, small a is the 3B. And opposite to capital C is the small c, so that is the P by 3 into B and opposite to B, B. Sum of three side, uh, third side, I will take uh, B. Hmm? This one because P we have to calculate now. So P by 3 into B with third side will be less than sum of two sides means 4B but greater than difference of this. Be clear difference not subtraction to B. We can see very clearly B by by anyhow I don't want B and 3 I can multiply. So it will become 6 less than P less than 12. That's all question over. They are asking integral value between, be clear, equal sign will not come. Integral value between 6 and 12, P equal to 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So how many integral value is there? 5 integral value is there. Finish question. So it means answer will be 5. Answer will be 5. Right? Very simple question. Only thing is that the equation looks uh, dirty. That you have to correct it. And that easily can be. It's a perfect square. So all these concepts are involved here. Right? So this was the question number 10. And that is the end of your section 1. Means 2 marks question we discussed. Now let's go to the discussion for the 11th question.